everyone. My name is Victoria Pakin from EasyRecipesWithTwist.com and today I'm here with my friends at RecipeLion.com who asked me to produce a video on this healthy and beautiful chicken casserole. So, let's get cooking! For this recipe you will need 3 cups of frozen vegetables. I'm using broccoli, corn and peas. 3 cups of shredded cooked chicken, uh, 3 fourths of the cup of all-purpose flour, half a cup of your beloved cheese, I'm using mozzarella cheese, 3 eggs, 2 tablespoons of uh, olive oil, extra virgin olive oil, half cup of milk, Italian seasoning, salt and pepper. Let's start making the butter. Three eggs going into the milk. One, two, and three. Oil going there as well. Seasoning. It's all, see, it's two tablespoons of seasoning goes inside. Salt and pepper. Salt in it and pepper. Sorry. Better. Mix it well. When you mix all together, add flour. I'm adding everything in one time and mixing. Now take the chicken in a really large bowl, chicken and vegetables, beautiful, and mix it well. Now when it's mixed, add your butter inside. You see the butter is quite thick and this is important because the vegetables are frozen and they will give up their moisture. So it will be absolutely perfect in the end. So add mm. nice. And mix with all the vegetables and chicken and you have to have a little bit of elbow grease here. Because it's thick, thick, thick. Take oiled pan, it's 9 by 13, and put all the casserole ingredients inside. Mm. It looks so good, smells so good. The seasoning makes it in the world. Level it up. Yep, mm -hmm. beautiful. And cover with your cheese on top. <laughs> it can get better than this. Chicken, cheese, vegetables. Yeah. I'm sprinkling, sprinkling all my cheese on top. Now, pop it to preheated oven to 350 Fahrenheit for about one hour. And see you there! Bye! This is how it looks after an hour. Let's cut the piece right away. Even though it's piping hot, but it oh, smells... Oh my god! So good! All the vegetables, all the cheese melted on top. Mm, yum! Mm, so good! Let's try it. Mm, so hot! Mm, but so good! I really hope you enjoyed the recipe. You should give it a go. 
really, it's really good. So, don't forget to subscribe, you know it's free. Comment below and thumbs up me and cheers, Victoria.